Hello YouTube building community, this is Marcos from Tortuga Costumes. How you, how you doing guys? So what you guys have here is um, funny car. I posted this one like as a complete project and I mentioned in that video that I needed to add the seat belts. Okay, so this is the time that I'm gonna put the seat belts on. That's why I left them behind because I want to do a tutorial video on this. Okay, so what, what we need actually is a seat belt material. In this case, we're going to use ribbons. Actually, a two millimeters uh, ribbons. You can find it any color you want. Any color. I mostly use the, the black one. And I have a green one that I haven't used yet, the yellow one that I haven't used yet, the orange one. And in this case, we're going to use the blue one. It's very simple. It's not complicated at all. I mean, don't get me wrong. These things, um, they look really nice when, when, when you put it on. But for me, it doesn't give you the, the, that realistic look that you're looking for. Or, or at least in my case. We're going to do something really quick here just to let you guys know how you can do it. Uh, I'm not going to do the entire thing, obviously, just to show you guys how to do it. So you can get this on eBay. It's a two millimeters um, ribbon and I forgot the name of the, uh, the seller, but it's like, I think it's four dollars for the entire pack. So it's 10 meters. So it's like, this is a lot. This is gonna last forever. On this case, we're gonna use this model model car garage um, photo edge part. So we're gonna use that one, and you can use this one if you want. These are the regular ones that comes another um, model car garage package. It comes with a very of those. I really used a lot of them <laughs> uh, in regular builds, but in this case, we're gonna use the five point harnesses. So. Basically, the kit give you this like molded in seat belts that you can paint yourself or you can add the, the decals on it. But like I said before, this is not the 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 the, the, the idea that I'm looking for. Okay, so I'm back. What we need is to cut our photo edge part. As you can see, on this one it doesn't oh yes they do. So they give you the the cutting points. Okay, so we have our four edge parts cut. Yeah, someday I'm gonna use this one again. I don't know. But now I have this. So I have this two. Oh, right, I me mean saying this two. Why you guys not watching what I'm doing? <laughs> cool, Marcos. Cool. Okay, so I got my my four edge parts cut. Then we're gonna need our ribbon material, my seat belt material. As you can see, two millimeters. This one is a, um, you can use it like very well for any photo edge set. Why I'm saying this? Because said since I started to use ribbon as a seat belt material. I've been having problems to find the right um, white, uh, I think it is, white, long, long, white, yeah. So I just have a difficulty on passing the, the seedling material over the photo edge part and most of the ribbons are too big. So I was trying to find something like it's really, really thing that goes to any of the the forage part that I've been using. 
So I found this one and this one so far is the best. So we're gonna use our crazy glue. This is the way I do it. It doesn't mean that it's the best way. But for me, it works just fine. Yeah, and you can tell, you see, it's really big, but I don't mind. This is a really nice piece. Let's try to keep it on the on the camera this time. So, I assume that you guys are asking, so why both two ends? Well, it goes this way, I can cut it right in the middle. And I got my two seat belts there. Easy peasy. Okay, so we have our piece there. Okay. So, we have this part that we're going to use, right? So it's supposed to be coming from one side, like a real car. And now I'm going to the bottom. Yay! We have it there. You guys can see it. Perfect. I'm gonna cut the excess on in the back. I don't need it. You can see we have like a really convincing seat belt. Nice. And now we have we need the next one. You can do it many ways that you want. Um it's, a, it's, it's not a, a complicated thing to do. Um, maybe some people can find it kind of hard, but it's really it's really easy. It's not that bad. So what we're gonna do now? We're gonna cut really small pieces. Two pieces. It's gonna be more than enough. And now we need it in an angle, right? What we need this for? So let me show you guys. We need something supposed to, to pull up to adjust the, the seat belt to the driver. As you can see, this piece is the, the top one. Goes under here. Exactly there. Don't worry, it's gonna look better now. 
So after we done this, okay, so we need our new piece. Here we go. Nice. In the bottom, in between the shaft, well, I'll put it this way, between the shaft and the seat, we're going to add our. Okay. Right now you see it right up, but it's going to be down in a minute. So now we need a little of glue on the photo edge part. Three seat belts on. They look really nice. As you guys can see. Really, really nice. And now we just need the long pieces. <laughs> Got it. So there we go. Now we have our seat balance. Now we can make a full display of this baby. So, like I said, this way they look more realistic. Um, yes, take a lot of time. I mean, I didn't take not even two hours, not even two hours, not even an hour, not even an hour to do this. Obviously, I need to prepare, get my ribbons, get my uh, my scissors, get my tweezers, um, my my good eyes, yeah. and uh, you know, just make common sense and how to to apply the the seat belts, uh, the way you want it, how they be laying down. Uh, the position of each other and all that but they look really really nice I'm gonna put some still photos at the end so you guys can see how they how they look they are not perfect obviously <laughs> but they look really nice um, better than I thought <laughs> so okay guys so I'm gonna let you guys go and I hope how you guys have fun with this and I want to thank uh, thank you all for just being around um, seeing all these um, crazy things that I do here uh, with my bad English <laughs> um, but no it's fun this is fun so I hope you guys enjoy it and this was um, something really fun to do and I hope you guys enjoy it so I give you I guess I see you guys on the next one Bye.